Okay, Boss Dog here, Boss Dog Coin Race. Getting ready for another penny hunt. I got another box from Utah. I had to open it up. It says LAX Coin on here. Okay, oh, I like these here with this light colored penny roll. Oh, they are circulated. I haven't looked for any enders. So let's get right after these pennies here. We're looking for the usual finds. Well, wheat cents, uh, Indian head pennies, error coins, S-minted coins, 1959s, foreigns. Let's get right in this box and see what we can find. Anyway, there may be some treasures in here. I will bring you in with the first find. Okay, fifth roll in. And there's our first wheat cent. I haven't had a chance to really look at the date. I saw, I turned it over, I saw the wheat in the back, but... There it is, first wheat cent in the box. It's a 19, I can't see that. Oh gosh, it's a smoothie. It's a smoothie. Well, that thing's been in circulation a long, long time, hasn't it? Let's see here. I'll take a look at it underneath the super loop. Looks like a 19, 191. I can make a 1916 or I can't tell. But anyway, I'll take a look at it under the super loop. We'll call him Smoothie. <laughs> I'll see if I can't figure out what he is. We'll put him right up there at the top, right there. Take a look here and see if there's anything in this roll. A smooth, oh, look here. Let's see if that's got the, that's a 2009. Let's see if that's got the double thumb error on it. Uh, no, uh, no double thumb error on it. Okay, that's our fourth 2009. And uh, nothing else in this roll? 45 rolls to go. Okay, nine rolls in. We just found our second wheat scent. I didn't see it when I spread it out because it was so dirty, but there it is. Dirty. Well, 1957, it looks like something's going on with that mint mark. No. Dirty. Okay, we'll put him right there. That's our second wheat scent. Let's take a quick look here and see if there's another one in here in this roll. Nothing else in this roll? Nine rolls in. Let's keep hunting. Okay, 17 rolls in from our box from Utah. And we have our third wheat scent. And it's almost an ender. It's right there. Almost an ender. So, let's take a look at him. Mm-hmm. Bum, 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 bum. 54S. 1954S. Okay, we'll put him right up there. We've got three wheat cents, so 17 rolls in. Not doing too good. we got a smoothie. I'll take a look at that later and see if I can't figure out what it is. And two wheat cents. That's it. 17 rolls. Let's take a quick look right here and see if there's any, see if he has any more friends in here. Let's stand right out. It's copper. Uh, copper. Nothing else in here. Not a lot of copper so far. So a few 2009, some estimated pennies, 17 rolls in. Let's keep hunting. Okay, I've got three rolls left. I've got three rolls left. And we just found our fourth wheat set fourth wheat set i found him looking at me right here 1956d we'll put him right up there fourth wheat set with three rolls left pretty bleak right I, i've got some interesting finds here to go over in the recap but as far as wheat sets it's been pretty bleak we'll take a quick look here in this bleak box and see if there's anything else in this roll 
Love it. Nothing else in this roll. Three rolls to go, and I'll bring you in with a recap. Okay, all 50 rolls hunted from Utah. Kind of bleak as far as as far as uh, wheat cents goes, but look at all the estimated pennies we found. Two 1969 asses, six 1970 asses, six 1971 asses, four 1972 asses, and a 73 S. Very low mintage. I've looked for the error coin, the 69S and the 70S small date. They're just not there. I've looked and looked. They're just not there. Found 13 2009s. I looked for the error on this coin right here, the, the extra thumb. Nothing there. I found three 1960Ds. I like to keep the 1960Ds. Sometimes you find a small date in there. That's a real 19, nice 1960D there. I've got rolls of 1960Ds. I keep them all. I started, after I started going through the roll here, I, I was noticing the 1962Ds. There was an awful lot of brilliant, like, uncirculated ones in there. And I just started keeping them towards the end of the hunt because it looks like somebody dumped a roll of 1962Ds uncirculated into the hopper. But look how nice those coins are. Look how nice they are. Beautiful. I've looked at them underneath the loop. There's hardly any scratches on them. Somebody took a roll of 1962Ds and just dumped them in the hopper. That's all I can figure. Found one Canadian. I don't need this one for the album. 1998 Canadian, my only foreign coin I found. Two 1959s. 1959Ds. I like 59Ds. First year the Lincoln Memorial scent was made after the wheat scent, so I keep all of them. And we found four wheat pennies. This in here, I've determined that this is a 1918. I've looked at it under the loop, I've looked at it underneath the scope. Uh, you can just, if you look at it kind of close here, you can kind of just barely make out that eight, but it is, a, it is an eight, it's a 1918, very smooth smoothie with a little dent right down the middle like it was bent in two but anyway that's no telling how long that's been in circulation look how smooth it is that thing probably been in circulation for over a hundred years for sure and a 1954 s and a 1956 d and a 1957 d all right there it is uh, we found uh, not a lot of not a lot of copper. A little bit, a little bit less than usual in the copper department. Some nice copper coins in there too. Some real nice, brilliant type, almost uncirculated, uncirculated copper coins in there. Uh, I'm going to do a video. I'm going to give this away. I, I have a comment video. When I reach 500 subscribers, I've been going back from 499 to 500 to 501 subscribers, but right now it's time to give this away. I've got a comment, uh, a coin roll hunting 500 subscriber giveaway comment video. This, it's not too late. After the 4th of July, I'm going to do a video and I'm going to give this American Silver Eagle away. 1992 American Silver Eagle. So go to my channel. Look for that comment video. Leave a comment. Make sure you leave Boss Dog in there as a key word. And when I come back for the 4th of July, some lucky person out there is going to win this 1992 brilliant uncirculated American Silver Eagle. So it's not too late. Go find that video. Leave a comment. And good luck to everybody. But anyway, uh, I hope you like this video. I've got some half dollars on the way. As soon as they get here, I'm going to be doing my first half dollar hunt, trying to fill up the silver jar. I've got, I've got two silver coins for the whole year in here. We're going to try to add, add silver to this. So anyway, I hope you like this video. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Please hit that notification button. I'm going to start giving away a little bit of something every 100 subscribers. You don't want to get left out. I, I, don't, I don't give away just measly little things. I'm going to give you something of value. Something similar to this American Silver Eagle. So you don't want to get left out. Hit that notification button. Also, I'll leave a link in the Epsi shop below. I, I make rings out of coins. So check out the description box. Hit that link. Go to my Etsy shop. Take a look at the coins. 
I have coin rings I have for sale there. If you see something you like, if you don't see something you like, message me and I might be able to make something you really like. So anyway, Boss Dog here today. I hope you like this video and I will see you soon.